and we have some ongoing snow showers across the region. So this is going to continue into the overnight. However, we're going to see those snow showers tapering off finally, and we are going to get some quieter weather as we head into the middle of the week. We'll talk about it. 30 degrees right now at BWI. The official high today, 36, well below average for this time of year. We're 32 in Annapolis, so we've already dipped below freezing in a lot of locations. And this is problematic. There will be some icy spots as we head into tomorrow morning if they aren't iced over already. Not only that, winds are brisk out of the north and west, so it feels even colder, feeling more like the teens for areas north and west, but the wind chill right around 20 degrees is what it feels like in Baltimore. Not to worry, high pressure is going to build in. It'll give us some relief, a little reprieve from this winter pattern that we've had, and that'll last through about Thursday, but then our next system heads our way late Thursday into Friday. Could bring a couple of snowflakes for areas north and west, but otherwise just rain elsewhere. And then we're going to be monitoring another system. You might have heard a lot of people talking about Super Bowl Sunday. Could there be a little snow? It is possible. One thing's for sure, we've got a lot of cold air that's going to start to work its way in from the Arctic. It's Arctic air mass that's pushing in. However, we're going to be watching the track of an area of low pressure that's developing near the Gulf. If it meets up just in time with the cold air, we are going to be talking about some snow in the forecast for Sunday. Not all models are in agreement on that, so stay tuned for that forecast. It is possible. This particular model says no way. That area of low pressure going out to sea, and then the cold air arrives behind. Regardless of snow or no snow, it is going to get very cold as we head into Monday. For tonight, a snow shower, some flurries around. Overnight low temperature right around 29 degrees. And then tomorrow, 39 for the high temperature, some morning flurries. That will be followed by clearing. So finally, the storm system is moving away on out, and we're going to get some nicer weather heading our way, and finally some sunshine returning as well. When we take a look at the seven-day forecast, I will show you a look at the very cold air that is heading our way. Again, that chance for some snow on Sunday, but 26 for the high temperature Monday. That's an Arctic blast, a low of 12. Over to you guys.